Hey all, it's Mooch. Welcome to Minding Your Moz. Today's just going to be a quick one to warn you to please don't use Google to search for my test results. Uh, several times a day, up to a couple dozen times every single day, I'm contacted by people who are confused, frustrated, even really angry because of things they're seeing in test results they weren't expecting or seem to conflict with something else. And this is because they use Google to search for the results. So why is Google a problem? Well, Google will return the list of hits or the list of pages that match your search terms or whatever algorithm it uses based on the number of views or how popular that page is. That's a big problem when it comes to my test results because the tests that have gotten the most views or looked at the most often are the oldest ones, the obsolete ones, the ones that have been replaced. If I have a four-year-old test and a four-week-old test that replaces the older test, the four-year-old test is the one that's going to come up in a search, and that's when you're going to go, aha. And I'm finding that very few people actually look at the date that something was posted. And this leads to test results they find from literally 2016, where I say, this is the best battery you can buy. And then it's not in the recommended batteries table. And people are like, what the hell? Or it's the other way around. I say a battery is a piece of junk, but it's in my recommended batteries table. And they're like, hey, what the hell? So I, I ask you to please just use the link in the description section below to my blog at ECF. The link is to the index page. From there, you can get my recommended batteries tables, my ratings tables, uh, to the list of every single test report I've done. All the information is there, and you only need to bookmark that one link. You can book the other links if you want to, of course, but that one link is all you need. And you don't have to use Google anymore, and you don't have to maybe get old test results, maybe get new ones, who knows? Now, I know Google's convenient, it's, it's what we always use, but for my test results, it's one of the worst ways to get the best information. That's all for today. Thank you for watching.